Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel guys. If you're seeing me for the first time then hi my name is Divya. I post a lot of fun content related to dentistry, sharing my experiences, taking you through my day to day life and so much more. So please 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 do consider subscribing to this channel if you haven't already and press the bell notification otherwise YouTube will not notify you of the videos I post. So today's video is about online resources part 2. If you want to watch part 1, I will leave the link in the description box below and in the iCards, so please do check that out. So without any further ado, let's get into today's video. So first, let's talk about this website that has been a total saviour for me when I was preparing for my MDS first year exams. Uh, this website is called Microbe Notes and it's exclusive to microbiology. Here you can see that they have the different categories under microbiology and on the top they have segregated this as all notes and microorganism notes. Under all notes you will find all the different topics and under microorganisms they have detailed description of each microbe. So here, for example, I'm clicking on, say, Streptococcus pyogenes. So the moment I click on it, we have a neat table of contents. As I've always said, even in my previous videos, that writing table of contents for a 10 marker will, will give a very good impression to the examiner. So you can follow that particular order, I mean, uh, that particular table, and you can uh, write the answers in this order. It is very structured, very detailed. I love how they've given everything in points. So, you know, it's very easy. The only downside of this uh, website is that they don't have a lot of diagrams, so you can definitely draw diagrams from your textbooks. So the second website that we have is called as MedNotes. Again, this is a superb website, especially for BDS first year and second year medical subjects. You can see that everything is so well structured and organized. So it's very easy to find what you're looking for. Uh, let me give you an example. So now I have entered the anatomy. So here I'm looking for a particular topic. You can see that everything is under each uh, chap, like everything is chapter wise. It's because we focus more on head and neck. I will take an example of say scalp so the moment you press on any topic it takes it's a google drive link and then you can see that all the handwritten notes have been uploaded here uh, the notes are also very clear and at the same time the diagrams are also good enough to reproduce another feature is that they have a separate category called as uh, and at um, sorry diagrams so the moment you press on that it takes you to this place where they have all the diagrams uploaded and it also has an option where it says upload your med art so if you have any of these diagrams that you would want to upload then you can go ahead it will obviously be very helpful to a lot of people they also have pictures of all the histological slides which i think is great because these are difficult to find at times so i think that's also a great feature in this particular website now this is a website that is absolutely great for all sorts of dental subjects and this is called the Dental Hub. Uh, here you can see that all the subjects are given at the top. You can click on to whatever subject that you want and uh, the, the topics uh, will be shown. The biggest uh, downside of this website is that not all the subjects have all the topics covered. But whatever they have covered, they are very, very good notes. So here, for example, you can say odontogenic tumors. Every, I mean, most of the notes are handwritten. So it's very detailed, very crisp, and at the same time, very good diagrams, which I think can be easily reproduced during the exams. It covers almost everything that you need. So I think that's a great, great thing. Uh, here I'll just show you what I'm talking about. So for example, pediatrics, you see you don't they don't have anything. So there are few subjects in which they haven't uploaded anything and there are few subjects that they have explained very well. Uh, one more thing that I found out that was really good is that they have options for you to download the important textbooks. So they've categorized each textbook. Uh, required for that particular subject and they've given you the downloadable link so you can download it from there so that's a big yay first youtube channel recommendation that we have today is by dr sandhya and this channel mainly focuses on carving tutorials this channel has been such a savior to me during my mds first year because if you guys didn't know then we had to carve both primary and permanent uh, dentition during our uh, mds first year and because i had forgotten a lot of my basics this channel has been so super useful as you can see she uses these big models to explain the morphology of the tooth and even when carving individual tooth 
truth she explains things through these models which is which makes the understanding process so much more easier she shows step wise demonstration so it's easier to you know carve alongside her you will understand how to carve better at the same time understand the structure of the tooth also so i think this is a great great channel for all those bds first year students who are struggling with carving and for mds first year pediatric students who want to carve so the second channel we have is by dr puji reddy again this channel has been so so useful to me especially uh, during my wire bending exercises uh, so her channel has been inactive for a while now but uh, she has covered all the important wire bending exercises and again during pedodontics first year like mds first year for pedo we have to do like all sorts of uh, wire bending exercises and because i have forgotten a lot again this channel has been so useful she shows a uh, step wise demonstration at the same time explains the process and i think out of all the channels on youtube which explains wire bending i found hers the most simplest and the best to understand uh, here you can also see that uh you know uh, the the video quality is slightly poor so that's the only downside of her channel but otherwise it's great now let's talk about my favorite 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 channel on youtube right now and that is a to z kids dental i cannot emphasize enough how much i have learned out of this channel uh they teach all sorts of endodontic procedures and i cannot tell you how useful this has been uh all this while and there is no way that i couldn't you know include this in this today's video because uh a lot of people have been asking me recommendations for endodontic procedures guys this is the channel that you must follow uh they have you know done such a great job with all the demonstration and uh, you know the the instruments that they use the procedures that they do everything is latest and very very appreciable here you can see that they've used used this plastic model to explain the procedure of uh, root canal treatment and uh, things like this make the procedure so easy to understand and they also have such a nice explanation that you can even make notes from them because uh, in on the clean in the clinical side if at all you need anything at any point you can quickly refer to these points and you're sorted here you can see that everything is so clean and so well presented i absolutely freaking lutely love this channel <laughs> So coming on to the last recommendation for today and that is Totwell Simplified. I recently came across this channel when I was preparing for my MDS first year exams and I was so happy that I could uh, come across this channel. If you see the main highlight of this channel is that they use a lot of diagrams to represent data. And at the same time their points are so concise. I mean their information is uh, put out in a point wise manner and they are so concise and crisp that you can easily make notes from them and when you're trying to recollect even if you forget forget some pointers those images will immediately pop up in your head and you can quickly remember what it was about and it's a great resource to make notes from so if you're looking for any channel that has great diagrams and also like point wise um, explanation i think this is your channel i absolutely love it video i really really hope that you guys liked it if you did then please give this video a huge thumbs up and please share it with your friends and family request you to please support this channel i put in a lot of effort in making this content and the only way you can support me is by engaging with the video by commenting by liking the video and by subscribing to this channel if you do that then it would mean the world to me thank you so much for watching until next time this is divya signing off